Welcome to our series called Toys to Teach. In this series, we will be sharing with you useful tips on how you can use learning tools and other materials to make learning more fun and meaningful at home. Enjoy watching! Good job, Joyce! Good job! A bright day to everyone who's watching. This is Teacher Cheryl and I know a lot of children are bored at home. And parents are at a loss on what educational materials am I going to give my child so that they can play and learn at the same time. So today's product feature or learning tool feature is our Snap Cubes. Our Snap Cubes comes in a set of 100 with 10 different colors and 10 cubes per color. And these are the things that you can do with our Snap Cubes. Starting off with sorting by color. So as you can see, all of the green ones here, all of the blue ones, white, black, orange, purple, green, red, yellow, and blue. You can also use this one for patterning. So what are patterns? You can turn it into blue, blue, green, green, blue, blue, and green, green. What kind of other patterns can you make? You can also make black, white, black, white, black, white. See? You have patterns. Okay? And you can also make use of your existing magnetic numbers at home or wooden numbers. And you can teach your child how to do one-to-one -one correspondence in terms of counting. So meaning I have number one. How many is number one? One, one. How about the next one? Two. I have two. So that's one and two. And I have three. So how many is three? I can put them together and form one, two, three. While you're doing that, your child is learning how to count accurately. Your child is also practicing their finger muscles, which is again very, very important for your child to be ready for their writing. You can also create something like this. This is our snap cube board or our counting board. So you can use the snap cubes like this and put it and shape it into number one. And what is one? It's just one snap cube. You can also put one here. There you go. So you can make two. So all you have to do is follow. This one will teach your child how to be able to write number two in a very interactive way. You can just connect them all together. There you go. And you have the number two. Just connect them all together. Then put them here. I have two. One, two. Okay. You can also use them for addition. See? 2 plus 2 is equal to, so you can use your snap cubes. I have 1, 2, and 1, 2. 2 plus 2 equals 2. If you put them together, it is going to turn into number 4. Again, you can use them and Try to use your magnetic numbers or your wooden numbers and you can mix them all up together while you are teaching your children math concepts. Okay, what else can we do with our snap cubes? You can actually use it as a measuring device. Just look at this part. See? How long is our thong? Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. It's 7 cubes long. You can also use our snap cubes for seriation from long, longer, longest. Tall, taller, tallest. 
you can also make letters out of it. This is the letter C. And the C says K, K, K. You can also use it to form your sight words. How do you spell the sight word the? T H E. How do you spell the sight word is? I S. And best of all, you can again use the snap cubes to stimulate your imagination and create whatever it is that you want. Teacher Cheryl created an airplane. The usage of the snap cubes are endless. Be as creative as you want to be in using this to teach, to learn, and to play. Thank you for watching our YouTube video for today. If you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you want to purchase this toy, please go to www.brightkidsph.com. Thank you again for watching and until our next episode. Bye-bye!